Hey everyone, I wanted to make a quick video about my study schedule and my study materials for the simile step one. First of all, the one that everyone is familiar with or should be is first aid. I'll be using the 2016 version of first aid. I will be using Pathoma. I will be using the Usimile RX question bank which is made by the creators of first aid and fourth I will be using the UWorld question bank and for those that aren't familiar with that you should be because from everyone's reviews that I've read and from other medical students at my university the UWorld question bank is by far the supreme question bank of all question banks um, and probably the best resource that you could use for your step one studying so every morning I'm going to be studying by 7 a.m. I'm going to be finished by 5 come home spend 5 to 7 with my family 7 to about 9, 9.30 I'm going to be watching Pathoma videos and annotating first aid with what's in Pathoma and then I will be in bed by 10 or 10.30. The plan is I want to get through all of the material completely two times um, in the first six weeks and then to use the last two weeks to review and hopefully get through all the material um, a third time I'm basically just reviewing the tough principles and my notes. How I'm taking notes is I am using Quizlet.com. It's really easy for me. I pull up um, a question bank and Quizlet's website right next to each other on my laptop. And um, I type up a quick flashcard if I can't remember a principle. Or I open up my first aid and I can make a quick uh, flashcard of a topic that I don't understand or that I don't remember. Um, and then I have that flashcard and that's something I can hurry and flip through at night or on the weekends on Friday or Saturday. Um, Monday through Friday is my, those are the 7 a.m. till 9, 9.30 study days um, with 5 to 7 open. Except for Friday, Friday nights, I'm leaving open for my wife and daughter. We'll go out and have fun together. I won't be studying. Um, and Saturday, I don't have a schedule for Saturday. Saturday is my makeup day. Um, except for Saturday evenings, I have Pathoma planned, a video or a chapter planned for Saturday evenings. Saturday during the day is my makeup day. So whatever I don't get to during the week, I have planned for Saturday. And if I've somehow miraculously made it through all the material during the week that I plan to, then Saturday will be my review day from everything from the week. So I personally, I started to do a digital calendar, but then it was much better for me to write my uh, calendar out on paper. Um, I went through like three of these before I finally uh, finalized my schedule. Um, and I like the paper version much better. Do whatever works for you. I liked making my own schedule. I know that there's websites out there that will make your schedule for you. I liked doing my own because it's my schedule and it's personalized to me um, and what I know that I'm able to do. And I tested it before um, I started studying today. Today was actually day one of Week one, I have eight weeks until my test. I will be taking one practice test in the middle, which will be after the first three weeks of my studying. So that means I will get through all the material one time, and then I'm taking a practice test. The plan is to get through the material two times. I'll get through it once in the first three weeks. I will repeat that in weeks three through six. Week seven and eight will be used completely for reviewing material 
reviewing what I have forgotten, the rapid review facts in first aid, um, and just literally scouring first aid, pathoma, the questions I've missed, um, questions I haven't finished. The first three weeks I'm using Usimly RX and I'm just trying to cruise through Usimly RX as fast as I can because I know it's not the best question bank. However, I feel like it's an excellent resource because it really helps me to pick apart first aid. Like today I did 60 questions. So, and in those 60 questions, there were some things that, that um, Usimly RX pointed out in those questions that I would not have gotten uh, from just sitting and reading uh, first aid. And the topic I was doing was renal. They linked um, some topics from, from different chapters and uh, it really helps to pull your studying together by doing those questions. So for me, using the Assembly RX is really helping me. I need, need to throw in there, I'm not sponsored by any of these companies. I'm just, this is my opinion. So take it for whatever it's worth because I'm not getting paid by any of these companies to say this crap. The plan is to get 1,500 questions done of Usimly RX. I wish I could get through all of them. There's like 2,400 questions in the first three weeks. If I miraculously can go in a hyperspeed mode and get through all of those questions, I will in three weeks, but I don't think it's gonna happen. I'll try. But then I want to reserve the last five weeks of my studying completely for UWorld. There's 2,400 questions in UWorld, and the last five weeks of my studying is going to be to 100% focus on your world to get through all 2400 questions um, to just pull those apart the plan at that point is I think that I'll know the material better and so I'm gonna do 132 questions that's 44 question sections three questions three sections a day I forgot to mention Sunday is a rest day for me I go to church and I spend time with my family, and I will not be studying on Sunday. If I get through all of the questions that I plan to, that means I will have done 1,500 questions in the first three weeks, and 3,300 questions in the last five weeks, which equals 4,800 questions total in eight weeks. Right now, I will add a screenshot of my study schedule so you can see which subjects I'm covering each day. Um, and the first three weeks are the same as weeks three through six. That's it. I hope that this video was helpful for you guys. Please subscribe to this video below. I will be adding more videos when I get some free time and hopefully I'll be adding more videos of my family's journey through medical school. And best of luck to everybody. Thanks.